<laughs> Hi, I'm Carla Sonheim. Thank you so much again for signing up for Faces 101. Today I'm just going to run through the supplies you'll need for the class. We'll start you out with an ultra fine point black sharpie pen, which is a felt tip pen, and a little thicker one, a mechanical pencil, and a ballpoint pen. You'll also need a selection of colored markers. These are the Sharpie permanent markers and some water soluble markers. And you'll need some colored pencils. You'll also need a piece of bind charcoal. This is the soft kind. And a red Conte crayon. And a black water soluble crayon. If you're finding you're having trouble finding this product, don't worry, there's lots of things you can substitute it with. Here's a portfolio oil based crayon that works. You just want to be able to smear the pigment with your finger and water. You'll also need some ink. I've recommended the FW acrylic ink, but you can also use concentrated watercolor or even India ink. You just want to make sure that you have an eyedropper that you we are going to be using to apply the ink on the paper. You'll also need some pastels and a kneaded rubber eraser, a small watercolor set and a number 12 round brush, and some toilet paper. For the drawing portion of the workshop, you'll need a stack of uh, paper to draw on. This is a 110 pound cardstock from the office supply store, but anything similar will work. And some watercolor sheets of paper. This is a smoother hot press kind that I like. And a selection of different kinds of papers from your studio. Since we're going to be doing so many faces, it'll be fun to work on different papers. You'll also need some family photos and photos of your relatives, real or imagined. Some fashion magazines or other magazines that have a lot of faces in them. And I really like to draw from my old yearbooks. I talked about the B list, which is an optional list um, supplies, but these are the colored Copic markers. You'll also need gesso, a brayer, and some spray fixative. Okay, that's all you'll need. We'll see you in just a few days.